welcome back to my youtube channel my name is tiffany if you're new here um so i was doing vlogmas for a little second i did like six days i recorded day seven but there wasn't really much to it so i never posted it and then after that i mean i just got so consumed with like school and work and uh so anyways but i did not finish vlogmas which that's fine i think i underestimated how difficult that was gonna be that's really hard to vlog every single day and then have time to edit it especially when you're a full-time student going through finals and you work full-time so <laughs> so that was really difficult and i just you know i just kind of fell off of it didn't have a whole lot of content to vlog you know so that didn't make it any easier but Anyways, we're back now. This is going to be my last video in 2022, but weekly uploads in 2023. Just wait on it. That'll be a lot easier for me. So yeah, that's where we're at right now. Um, it is currently December 29th, so I hope you guys all had a very Merry Christmas or whatever you celebrate. I celebrate Christmas, as you can see by the title. I'm going to be doing a What I Got for Christmas 2022. Um, I i love these videos personally um so i really like to watch them and see what everybody got and i know that it's not everybody's thing but i've always really liked them so that's why i want to film one because i want to show y'all what i got by no means am i you know bragging or anything like that i'm very appreciative for everything i received from my parents from everybody that i know but yeah that's what i'm going to be doing today i do have my festive little earrings on even though it's no longer christmas and i got my nails done which I very much love this. I love my nail girls. So first, my work, my old job, we did a secret sister kind of thing. I never got one. I don't know why. But this girl I worked with, who's also, you know, one of my friends, she was my secret sister. So she got me stuff, which was so nice of her. I did not expect her to give me as much as she did. She's so sweet. Um, but yeah it was just really nice of her <laughs> uh everything was just so cute i'm very grateful thank you so much and i did get her something as well um even though i wasn't technically her secret sister but she told me that she got me stuff and that you know because i had quit so she was like hey i got you stuff um but you know how you gonna get it kind of stuff and i was just like you know i'll come by and get it so i gave her her thing and she gave mine and yeah it was just so cute but this is what she I dropped the bag this is what she got me this is my favorite color so <laughs> and then she got me these scrunchies which like ombres down they're also purple and i love scrunchies so this was a good one for me um and then she also got me a snickers bar and a reese's like king size bar but those are gone like i ate those but and then lastly she gave me 25 dollars to bath and body works because whenever we filled out the secret sister sheet i think i put that i like bath and body works and that my favorite scents winter candy apple uh, like so yeah that's how she knew all that stuff about me but she's so it was so nice it was so unexpected i didn't like i wasn't expecting that and i love the cup so much like that is my favorite color i don't even think i have anything in my favorite color which is like weird but like it is what it is i guess <laughs> but yes thank you if you're watching the next thing i'm gonna show y'all is stuff i got from my friend's family she gave me this little goodie basket. First, she gave me this little snowman that says love. I've had it sitting up on my shelf, but I took it down for this video. But yeah, it was so cute. Um, she gave me a soap as well as a Germex and a candy cane. And she must have put some like little snowflake like fluff in there because I've never seen that. And it's so cute, but... Yeah, it smells really good and I just, I love it. I love Bath and Body Works, obviously we've already established, so very good gift for me. <laughs> um, she also gave me this candle, which smells so good. I've already burnt it a little bit. Um, but yeah, autumn in the Midwest. So I'm from the St. Louis area, so basically... I don't know this just smells so freaking good but that's why midwest like i'm from st louis so but um i burned this candle one time and it was like when i had first got it so probably like a week ago 
and I only burned it for like an hour or two. And every time I come in my room, I smell this damn candle. It's like, it's still hanging around, but it smells so good. The next thing she got me is this little heart crystal because we're crystal girlies. Um, if I had to take a guess, this is amethyst, but don't quote me. Like, I'm not good at spotting crystals and telling them what they are, but just based on like the purple hues and stuff, it looks like amethyst to me, but I could be wrong. Definitely could be wrong. The next thing she got me was this goat milk soap um body soap and it's called goat meal i guess but it smells good and i haven't used it yet but i will and i've never um had any goat milk soap i've only had goat milk um hand lotion and i like that a lot so i would assume that i would like this as well but yeah this will be fun to use i just i have had it sitting in my little basket so because <laughs> the presents have just been accumulating in my room for christmas which very grateful <laughs> um and lastly she gave me some incense which i am excited about because i don't have any incense i have never bought any incense uh i've burned it over there at their house like because they she has incense and my friend likes to burn incense but i've never burned incense in my house at my own you know so <laughs> excited about that too um and i don't have it down here i hung it up but she got me this little crystal that has like a lot of different faces i guess if that makes sense and it's supposed to keep the energy circulating around your room it's really pretty but i hung it with my dream catcher so yeah because i have a hook on my ceiling so i hung it up there but yeah, that is what she gave me. Next, I'm gonna show you what my parents gave me for Christmas. Um, so I don't know if this is supposed to be a Christmas gift or not, but my mom gave it to me because on New Year's, we're gonna be staying home and me and her are like BFFs. So we're gonna be staying home and getting crunk ourselves. So she gave me a drinking game <laughs> um, that we are gonna play on New Year's and actually i have another one the other thing she had me order now this wasn't supposed to be a, a christmas present i ordered this on my amazon because i have amazon prime because i'm a student so i knew about this but this is cat face and it's the drinking edition and what we didn't realize is that we don't we don't have the original game we need the original game <laughs> for this to make any sense so I still need to order the original game, but this is like the drinking add-on, so I should probably do that. I'll see, I'll see if I can get it <laughs> before New Year's. I doubt it at this point, but we can see. So first, my mom got me these kitty cat flannel sheets, and I have them on my bed right now. So this is actually the top sheet cover, which I never use. I hate those things, so judge me if you want, but I don't like them. So I don't ever use that, but I do have the pillowcases on and the fitted sheet on, but it's so cute. Um, you can kind of see the design. The next thing my mom got me was a rocket book. Um, if y'all don't know what this is, you've probably seen it before because I know I have. I have seen it before, but I was just like, it's never something that I would have thought to buy for myself. It's a really nice, like cool gift though. You know, I just wouldn't have bought it for myself because I mean, I don't know it's just not it's like one of those things you wouldn't buy for yourself you don't know like you want it but like you don't buy it does that make sense I, I think it makes sense but it's like a cute cool gift to have because the special thing about this notebook is like it has like I don't know maybe like 20 sheets of paper in here um but this is what it looks like and then when you open it up it's just a blank sheet of paper right but it has this little QR code so Basically, this is a special kind of paper, and whenever you write on it with this pen right here, which it comes with, um, this is an erasable pen as well, so you write on it and then the fibers in the paper like soak up the like pen, I guess, the ink, and then when you scan this QR code at the bottom, it knows everything that you put on this page, which kind of cute, kind of cool. <laughs> Um, and then it comes with this little eraser thing as well. So there's several pages here. <clears throat> I thought that this was super cool because I'm going into um, a university, like I said, which, you know, I've already been in college and stuff, but now I'm going to a university, which sounds a little fancier than community college. 
but I was figuring like if I ever need to like draw something and put it in my Google Drive like this would be very helpful so yeah that was super cute so the next thing my parents got for me was I was so excited about this because I did not ask for this but I have wanted one and I was thinking about buying one for myself and I was just like no way when I opened it okay it's a blend jet so <laughs> I've been asking my mom for a freaking blender for a long time so I think that this is her way of giving me a blender and uh, I love it I'm, I was literally gonna buy one for myself so crazy and i was like no i won't i'll wait or you know at some point i don't know but i didn't ask for it she gave it to me when i opened it i just saw this and i was like no way and i opened it, i was like you got me a blend jet you got me a blend jet <laughs> um but yeah it's in my favorite color so i guess i lied i do have something in my favorite color so now i can put this with my new cup and i can have a smoothie the next thing that I got, and I actually did ask for this, was Daisy by Marc Jacobs. This is the Uso, I don't know how to say that, Uso Fresh. <laughs> um, this is what it looks like out of the box. I just think the bottle is so pretty, but I love the scent too. It's very light and feminine, and I really like that. So this is what she looks like. I love the bottle, love it, but the smell is also so good and it's so light and girly i feel like and i'm a little girly girl so it fits the next thing that my parents got me were these friend socks and they're like fluffy you know fresh out of the shower put lotion on your feet type of fresh and they're friends themed which is if not my favorite show of all time one of my favorite shows of all time so i love friends the next thing i got came from my uncle and his girlfriend so this is an led makeup mirror which i am obsessed with it first of all it's pink and i very much enjoy pink so it's like rose goldy kind of looking um but i do have a travel size mirror like this from vanity planet but it's like you know it's a travel size so it's kind of small like it works and that's what i've been using but I'm excited for this because this is like big and it opens up on both sides so I can see both sides of my face and yeah I'm just this was definitely a Tiffany gift. The next gift I got was from my brother um, and he thinks he's super funny and these I'm the only person he does this to okay he doesn't do it to my mom well our mom and he doesn't do it to our dad okay. He only does it to me. So he gave me a card that says, Sister, you're um, amazing. I'm amazing. And, and then you open it and it's a happy birthday card. Okay. <laughs> um, and he gave me a Target gift card and on here, happy Hanukkah. <laughs> he only does it to me. But, you know, that's fine. We're not discriminatory here. He just thinks he's funny. The next thing I got is from my aunt who does not live nearby but she mailed us all a bunch of like stuff for Christmas and we did the same for her kids because her kids are um, 9 and 6 so they're young and honestly Christmas is all about the children in my opinion so we sent them a bunch of stuff for Christmas so she sent us some stuff back. Um, so this is the pink candy set so it comes with a uh, perfume a shower gel a roller perfume and then i believe a lotion so and i took it out of the box and i smelt it and it smells really good and yeah it's super cute i'll definitely add it to my collection as well love body care love skin care we'll do anything the next thing my parents got me um they got me a couple like sleep shirts from pink and uh one of them's actually in my laundry at the moment because i already wore it so but it's black and it has like pink written across it and rainbow it's just super cute and basic and then they also got me sleep pants from pink so they're just black but they're so comfortable um and then they also gave me this sleep shirt which is kind of the same concept like it's the same feel as the other one just looks different and it's super cute and super soft so excited about that so the next couple of things are from my dad specifically so first he got me he got me this which is an ornament of my kitty cat which i think i'm gonna use it as a keychain but so cute i love her so much and then it comes with like you know a little ribbon and he also gave me and my brother this keychain that says don't do stupid shit love dad 
so I was like okay I'll think of you every single time I'm doing stupid shit <laughs> and then he gave uh, me and my brother a silver coin that I don't know if it'll pick it up but it says Merry Christmas and then on the back it's got Santa so you know riding away in his sleigh so that was super cute and then our me and my brother's like bigger gift from him he gave us both in a little envelope um that said merry christmas love dad and inside of it were tickets to a blues game so we're going to the blues game <laughs> uh in april last home game of the season the next thing my mom got me which i don't think this was like coincided but she got me a blue shirt which it's like a jersey it's not like a hockey jersey but it's a jersey type of shirt which are my favorite shirts so some of my favorite i guess i should say but yes love her the next thing that my mom got me are these silk sea sponges and i've never seen anything like this before it's honestly pretty cool so they're actually from i think she said the gulf of mexico um and they were like literally sponges like somebody deep dive to get these <laughs> like literally sponges from the gulf of mexico like isn't that cool so i have two of these these were ordered off if you guys are interested they were ordered off crate and barrel i believe which um i don't think i've ever heard of that store either before honestly but yeah comes with two you know you kind of get them wet they can be used to remove makeup and they can also be used for skincare i have not used them yet i don't know if i'll use them to remove makeup because i have so many makeup erasers but i'm very excited to see how they work with like applying skincare so <laughs> stay tuned um but yeah this was really cute a uh, cool and cute unique gift that i wasn't expecting uh i like i said i haven't really seen anything like this before and it's really cool to think about like oh they went down to the gulf of mexico and picked out sponges and they're in my house now another thing that my mom got me i actually asked for this um this is a amica blonde boogie shampoo conditioner and a hair mask set so these are just purple shampoo and the conditioner just to keep your hair blonde like not so brassy and stuff my hair is not super brassy but i do use purple shampoo like once a week right now i'm using bylage but i've always wanted to try amica i've just like never put my own money towards it so this was like you know a good gift i thought for me because i have been wanting to try amica and then it also comes with the bust your brass intense repair mask so i've heard good things about amica so i'm excited to try this one of the other things i asked for which this has been around for a little bit but i'm so excited about this i have wanted one of these since they came out and i just i never bought one um it is a Canon mini photo printer. So basically it Bluetooths to your phone and you can like print out personalized like um, Polaroids from your phone, which is so freaking cool. <laughs> I love Polaroids. I like that aesthetic. So, and I used to have a Polaroid camera, but I actually ended up getting rid of it because I didn't want to keep buying film for it. I didn't really feel like I used it a whole lot because you have to kind of take those pictures in the moment and I feel like I take a lot of pictures on my phone so it wasn't super beneficial for me but this I think I'm gonna spend a lot of money on film not gonna lie so one of the final things that my mom got me this year was these Ugg boots which I'm so excited about I've wanted these for a couple of years now or at least a year you know ever since they came out kind of um, I remember people when I was in high school wearing them walking around. <laughs> um, this is my second pair of Uggs. I had the original like chestnut ones that went up to, you know, mid mid calf kind of length. And I really, I loved them. I just didn't take care of them very well. And well, I can't really say that because I mean, I had them for like four years. So they were really good shoes and they're very comfortable, but they did get, you know, tarnished with time. So it just happens. But I asked for these, which I love them. They're so comfy. Literally gonna be a staple in my college career, I think. So, um, but I, I got them in chestnut because I really like that brown color. Um, I'm gonna insert some pictures here because uh, my bed's covered in other things, but she got me a fluffy white weighted blanket that I asked for, which uh, was from Wayfair. So I'll insert a picture of that right here. And then she also got me two blankets 
just like regular blankets i love blankets i'm very cozy and then lastly my two grandmas so my grandma on my dad's side got me an array of things i don't have them for i don't have them right here with me but she gave me 50 dollars. she gave me a dr teal's like bath set um calming kind of i think it's eucalyptus so that was really nice and she also gave me a cat blanket my grandma who is on my mom's side who currently lives with us she gave me this shirt which i again it's in the dirty clothes i've already wore it but it's a sleep shirt and i will insert a picture of it because it is so cute i'm gonna have it forever so basically it says official sleep shirt and then it has a picture of me asleep which not me but like a character that looks like me like blonde hair white girl <laughs> and it says Tiffany and then next to it it says Gabby and then there's a cat that is the same color as Gabby so very cute warmed my little heart very happy about that that is all every everything everybody got me for Christmas except some stocking stuffers which I'm gonna show you with a little bonus round the stuff that i bought me for christmas so here's a little haul of what i bought me for christmas <laughs> first things first okay um i used to work at a hair salon if y'all did not know that so basically this hair salon also had a boutique attached to it which i'm not gonna name where it is or what it's called because first of all no free clout second of all um it's local so i don't really want y'all to know all that but yeah, so whenever I quit, I, um, they owed me $50 and a ring light because I advertised their business for a month and it was kind of like a contest and I won. So I ended up getting my ring light and then I also got a $50 gift card to the boutique. So I bought some earrings because I really liked their earrings. So I don't know how I'm going to show y'all this without showing y'all the name of the company, but... I'm gonna figure it out. So these are the first earrings that I bought. Very cute, been eyeing them for a while, so I was excited to purchase these. One thing I will say is that they do have very pretty earrings um, and they're all like lightweight, which I really like. So I was excited to buy some earrings that I've been wanting. These super cute like little suns at the bottom. Um, yeah i've just i've really liked these since i started working there as well lastly i got these which i know are a little out there but i liked them a whole lot uh, you can kind of see the pattern but yeah no they're just super cute i was very excited to cop all of these and all of these costed 60 dollars, so i paid 11 dollars for three pairs of earrings which isn't that bad this is my big Christmas present to myself. Um, <laughs> I went to Ulta. So basically what I was trying to do here, <clears throat> I am the closest to becoming a platinum member of Ulta than I have been in my entire life. So I was $121 away from being platinum, right? So I was like, you know what? Screw it. I was gonna, I went to Ulta and I spent $150. So whatever you know um which is funny because actually i had a 20 percent off coupon which brought me down to 124 dollars so i spent 124 dollars right okay well it don't include tax right so now i'm seven dollars short of becoming platinum so i ordered something online which should push me over but if the points don't deposit by december 31st what happens so i'm like if my points do not show up tomorrow i'm driving back up to ulta and i'm just gonna buy something for seven dollars because i'm this close I'm this close I'm not I'm not playing with y'all I'm gonna show y'all everything I got from Ulta but first I gotta show y'all what my mom put in my stocking this year which I all put in here because they it's a bunch of uh face masks and also a couple perfume samples so let me make sure I got them all um very much into skincare very much a girly girl like I said so uh the first perfume sample that i got was dolce and gabbana i believe she ordered something from sephora and this came with it so yeah it smells super good this is light blue by dolce and gabbana and the second one is um wood by tom ford which i didn't like know i thought tom ford i thought this was a cologne so i was like oh okay but 
like I looked it up and it says it's unisex and then I smelled it and I was like yeah that could definitely go either way so like you know I don't know I thought it was a cologne but I don't think it is the first one is the Cubella um pore minimizing t-zone in full facial mud mask with peppermint oil cooling camphor and grape extract very nice and BNC. I'm not gonna read all of them out like that but just for the effect this one was super cute this is a fantasy by mask bar santa purifying sheet mask this one is a bio republic lip mask this one is a holler and glow you're so golden babe under eye mask then i have a avatara i don't know if i'm saying that right juicy pineapple exfoliating pineapple mask then I have the Aveeno Repairing Foot Mask, which I've actually used these before. I don't know if I've used this specific one, but I've used foot masks from Aveeno before, also hand masks, and I really like them. They make my feet pretty soft, so excited. <laughs> then I have the Avatara, again, Juicy Peach Beach Brightening Peach Mask. Then I have the Diamond Eye Brighten and Deep Puff Eye Mask, which gonna be impossible to see that but <laughs> then I have the Cubella exfoliating strawberry peel off mask I really like Cubella's peel off masks so I'm very happy about this in the mud mask and lastly I have this juicy avo bravo soothing avocado mask by Avatara again and then she also got me a oh sorry a $25 Starbucks card or I think it's $30 Starbucks card and a $60 Panera card which it was 50 but you got 10 extra for buying 50 so yeah I'm gonna be eating healthy I'm gonna eat healthy and I've been drinking coffee <laughs> I'm gonna go through what I got at Ulta so first I picked up some cotton rounds pads because I needed them and they were just there I mean honestly I probably paid a little more than I would have if I just would have bought them at Target but I mean whatever i was there so <laughs> next i got this makeup revolution irl filter um finishing powder it's translucent i haven't used a translucent finishing powder um since my elf days so and i i didn't dislike elf's finishing powder so i'm excited to see if this one lives up to the hype the next things i got from ulta i think i've talked about this in a previous video but i just picked up some more of my morphe eyebrow pencils in the shade latte i used the micro brow pencil to do my whole eyebrow look i am makeup free today but yeah this is what i usually use so i just picked up a couple more because i feel like i go through them so fast <laughs> but i don't know let me know if anastasia doesn't like break easy because i feel like the one thing about these is that they break easy it's so, like you put any kind of pressure on them at all i feel like they snap which is so annoying but i love them so i don't want to switch out of them but honestly if anastasia doesn't break easy i might splurge so let me know <laughs> the next thing i got which i actually did need this i was almost out was the makeup revolution sport fix finishing spray which i know i bought the finishing powder but i love this finishing spray honestly the next thing i got was these kiss um eyelash glue adhesive and it's just in the shade clear um i just got this because i know i bought lashes and i think i talked about this in a previous vlog i bought lashes from Ulta like I don't know like early in December and I couldn't remember if I had lash glue at home um so while I was there this was just like in the little section in line where you can pick up like travel size and stuff and I was like oh you know it's only six bucks and I think the lashes I have are by Kiss um or they might be our down I don't know but anyways I just picked up some lash glue the next thing I got I'm super excited about this this was more like my Christmas gift <laughs> like the other stuff I kind of needed I mean and then like I picked this up which I didn't need it but it was kind of cool but this baby was my Christmas gift this is the Anastasia Beverly Hills glow kit in sugar so very happy about that that's the shades I right here I'm not gonna pull it out of its packaging but um yeah, I have the glow kit in the, I think it's called Sunkissed. I don't know. It's it's the one that was really, really popular. Um, I have that one, but I wanted to get this one. It's like a little more light, I feel like, and there's like a pink 
There's a butterscotch, a gumdrop, and a marshmallow, and the pink one's called Starburst. So I think that's gonna be super cute. And I also picked up the All Amethyst palette from ColourPop. Um, yeah, they just sold me on this, to be honest, because I like amethyst. I love the color purple. Purple's my favorite color. And I love ColourPop, so it worked out. <laughs> uh, let me go ahead and show y'all the shades in here. Yeah, definitely amethyst. So, but it's super cute. I love the packaging it comes in. I'm excited to use it. One of my resolutions is definitely to get ready more often. So I want to definitely do my makeup and just, you know, it makes me feel like a more productive human all around when I do my makeup. So I'm sorry, this video is going to be so long, but worth it. The next thing I got from Ulta was this Clinique, all about clean um, cleansing, uh, cleanser, foaming cleanser. And this is for combination oily to oily skin, which I'm pretty sure I'm a combination oily girl. Uh, cause I get really oily, but at the same time, it's not necessarily everywhere. I'm not, like, I feel like I'm a normal to oily kind of skin type. So the last thing I got from Ulta, which I wasn't gonna buy, but <laughs> you know, whatever, it's Christmas. Um, I got the Kenra Lux All-in-One Miracle Spray, the leave-in. Um, actually has little gold flakes inside of it. I mean, don't get too excited. It was like $26, so it's not that extravagant, but <laughs> basically it's just an all-in-one kind of spray. But yeah, I can see the little like gold flakes in it, which is so cute. <laughs> um, I used it this morning and I feel like my hair is very, you know what, actually, okay, my hair is very shiny. In general, I have pretty healthy hair, but I usually put my Paul Mitchell Skinny Serum in my hair and I did not do that today because I put this in instead and I did put my Paul Mitchell on my ends though, which I typically do, but you know, I feel like she's looking really good right now. So kind of, it might actually be a miracle spray. That is the complete what I got for Christmas 2022 vlog well not vlog video and also the last video of 2022 so yeah I hope y'all enjoyed doing watching this as much as I enjoyed filming it um I love these type of videos like I said so very much into it so I hope y'all enjoyed um if you did make sure you give a like and definitely comment down below what the videos you'd like to see in 2023 very excited about 2023 and yeah I will see y'all next year okay <laughs> all right bye